happy. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Jade and today I'm watching Comey Can Communicate episode 11 and before I get into it, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I post a new video. I can't believe we are getting close to the end. We are literally one episode away from the end. I believe there are going to be 12 episodes. Oh, I'm not ready for this season to end. I have enjoyed every single moment and I felt so proud of Comey and how far she's come and all the friends she has made. And I'm pretty sure she doesn't even need a hundred to know who her solid group is. But oh, especially last episode. Last episode, Comey got jealous. She got jealous of Onemine because Onemine and Tadano were together and because Onemine was helping Tadano. But good on Onemine for literally being such a cute person. She saw the situation and was like, oh, I'm sorry for getting between you two. And I think that that is another person in Komi's life that's going to be a good friend to her. Um, I got emotional with the sports festival when Comey fell and all her classmates were like still cheering her on They were worried about her and I love how they didn't care whether or not they won or they lost They just cared about whether Comey was okay And I think most people in their lives would just want that kind of community or like support system where it doesn't matter if you like mess up you have these people that only care whether or not you are okay I don't know if I explained that right but <laughs> that is what I felt and I felt like I was gonna cry I kind of feel like choked up talking about it too but we are nearing the last episode and I just want to enjoy these last episodes with you guys so let's get into it what is happening oh <laughs> I love Najimi. <laughs> of course! <laughs> Poor Komi! I like how they're using Komi because everyone's like, they love Komi. Wow, man. Oh, poor Komi. She wants to help. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I love these like little late responses. <laughs> She, I think she'd like to because she wants to help. <laughs> of course, everyone wants to go now. <laughs> Good thinking. <laughs> so funny. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think so. Yeah. 
<laughs> I feel like I want to cry. I feel so happy. <laughs> and there was like no hesit, like actual like, shaking hesitation. Oh, a toddler must feel so happy about this. I'm so happy about. Oh my goodness. Come on, then, Jimmy. <laughs> I love the confidence that she's like gaining a little bit. Oh, <laughs> she ate. <laughs> oh. Did she make that one? Okay. 
simple. <laughs> Come on, Mr. Expert. <laughs> oh, that's a really cute one. Different kind of characters, yeah. <laughs> I think she's just looking. I... I don't think that was it. <laughs> that is not it! <laughs> she's just nervous. <laughs> Aww. So freaking weird. Oh, the brother. <laughs> wow. I love the fact that we are ending the season with a school festival. It's so upbeat and it's so nice and there's so many cute moments. But I, th I think I was the sh most shocked and very happy and proud when Komi, without like just the normal, typical shaking hesitation of responding, she said she responded to Onemine and Otori. And I thought that was so nice because normally she'd like be shaking, doesn't know what to say, and she just like, outwardly said it and I, I got like a little choked up there because I was like so happy and I like that now little by little you can tell she's like saying a little bit more like in that maid situation she was halfway there halfway halfway there but I I'm just so happy and I'm so proud of her and I'm so looking forward to the next episode the second part of the school festival I wonder what more is gonna happen. A lot of magical things normally happen in these like animes with the school festival, so I wonder what that's gonna be. But I'm glad that Komi was able to make a new friend. She was able to get more out of her shell throughout the season and be able to speak a little bit more. And I love the relationship with Tadano that she has with Tadano because it's so wholesome. I say that all the time. And I think at the pace that they are going, it's just so nice. And you can tell that she is so appreciative of everything that has happened in her life and oh, I'm just so happy about it. It just makes me so happy and I'm kind of sad knowing that the next episode is going to be the last episode of the season but I will be looking forward to any future seasons that will happen. But that is all I have today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye!